I'm Sister Emily Bayada. I'm the Vocation Director for the Daughters of St. Paul, and today we're going to take you on a tour of our convent. This is the Vocation Office, so this is where I work, but now we're going to go see the rest of the convent. Let's go. So this is the most important room in the house, our chapel. Um, this is where the sisters pray every day. We have morning and evening prayer together. Um, some days we have mass in our chapel. Other days we go out to the parish for mass. Um, we make a half hour of meditation on the gospel every morning right here in this chapel. And every day each sister makes an hour of adoration, which we call our visit with Jesus, because it's meant to be like we're visiting with a friend and telling him everything and listen to him as he gives us light and grace for our lives. Um, so we make our visit with Jesus here, and then we have an additional half hour of personal prayer sometime during the day as well. Um, so this is where all of this takes place. Uh, each sister has a place in chapel, um, and we love to come here to spend time with, with Jesus, who is our beloved, who is the, the one who has called us here and brought us all together. Um, you'll also see in our chapel our devotions to Mary, Queen of Apostles. Um, Mary is pictured giving Jesus to the world, which is our mission as Daughters of St. Paul. And then over there in the corner we have a smaller St. <laughs> Paul the Apostle. Um, and St. Paul is of course our patron and our father and our protector um, of our congregation. He's the one who inspires us in mission and also in our spiritual life. Um, so we'll be praying for all of you right here in this chapel. So let's continue on our tour. for now. Wonderful. Pray for us. Okay, I pray for you all. Thank you. So this is our living room. This is where we gather for community meetings, um, other community gatherings and sharings, and also community recreation, which we have a few evenings a week. Um, right now, as you might be able to see, we're very into puzzles. We also like to play games. Um, and as media nuns, we do try to keep up on movies and television shows, so about once a week or so, we'll watch a movie together and talk about it after, um, and how we can share the gospel with people, maybe through that movie. Um, so this is where we do all of that. Also just kind of informal, hanging out, chatting together, uh, working on projects. Um, so kind of a living room, maybe just like yours, uh, right here in our convent. Okay, now we're going to go to uh, another very important room, our kitchen. So this is our refectory or dining room. Refectory is just a big fancy convent word for dining room. Um, but this is where we have all our meals together. Um, community is really important um, for religious life and for us as Daughters of St. Paul. So. You saw in chapel we pray together, and up in the living room we, um, we have fun together, watch movies together. Um, here we eat together, and um, we also take turns cooking for one another. So about once a week, each sister will sign up to take her turn cooking, um, and, and then all the sisters get to enjoy that together. Uh, so yeah, breakfast, lunch, and supper, we eat here. Um, and actually, it looks like there's someone in the kitchen right now. Let's go see who it is. Hi, Sister Chalestina. Hello. Are you making supper? Yes. Thank you so much. You're welcome. See you later. See you later. Okay. We've come to the last stop on our tour. We're about to enter our Pauline Book and Media Center, our bookstore. Um, so the mission of the Daughters of St. Paul is to proclaim the gospel using all forms of media. So that includes books, radio programs, video, um, and now of course internet and digital and social media. Um, here in our bookstore, this is one way that we are able to use the media to give Jesus to all people. Um, so we have sisters who work each day in our book, so book center, meeting the people who come in, listening to their needs and their prayer intentions, um, and directing them to resources that will help them grow in their relationship with God. 
Um, we also have sisters who work uh, creating content, um, designing, writing, producing um, some of the editions that we have right here in our bookstore, um, as well as many other things that you, you can see online, on our website, on our social media. Um, so we're so blessed to be here, to have this, this place from which we can give Jesus um, to everyone who comes in and then bring those people in our hearts to prayer when we go back up to chapel. Uh, so let's take a look around the book center. Thank you. Bye.